The Islamic militia group ISIS, formerly known as Al-Qaeda in Iraq and recently rebranded as the so-called Islamic State, is a stuff of nightmares. They are ruthless, fanatical killers on a mission. And that mission is to wipe out anyone and everyone from any religion or belief system and to impose Sharia law. The mass executions, beheadings and even crucifixions that they are committing as they work towards this goal are flaunted like badges of pride. Video taped and uploaded for the whole world to see. Evil has shown us the new face in 2014. But who armed and trained them? We remember that CIA was actively helped the Libyan rebels against Gaddafi. But who was that rebels? The fact that the leader of the Libyan rebels, Abdel Hakim al-Hazidi, admitted that his fighters included Al-Qaeda-linked jihadists who fought against Allied troops in Iraq. Remember, ISIS was Al-Qaeda before it was rebranded. With the assistance of US and NATO intelligence and air support, the Libyan rebels captured Gaddafi and summarily executed him in the street, all the while enthusiastically chanting Allah Akbar. For many of those who had bought the official line about how these rebels were freedom fighters aiming to establish a liberal democracy in Libya, this was the end of their illusions. ISIS became the threat of international community.